rip, rip, rip. Hey, rip, rip, rip. doing I am out here there's my truck over there but I wanted to show y'all where I'm at I'm in a place I guess they call it Lake uh, Lake Gunners Gunnersville in Alabama I'm over here at the um, pilgrim uh, the pilgrim something picking up a load going to Indiana so this is the uh, staging area so they have us come down here and park right there until they're ready for us to load. So they got this nice little lake over here. Ripley. So I got Ripley out here. Um, I wish I had a fishing pole. I didn't know it was going to be a, like a lake lake that you could go like fishing in. But I'm almost out of time, so I think what I'm going to do is um, is stay at the little hotel that they got down the street. So, um, but this is a nice little area. Look, they got the where the trucks can just park over there, and it's not busy. It's like a small little town, and we wait to get loaded, and then. Um, my load canceled. I had a load picking up today at um, in um, Columbus, Georgia. Got a chance to meet Hani, and um, my load canceled, so I didn't even get a chance to get no donuts or nothing because I wasn't able to pick up the load. So they sent me up here to Gunnersville, Alabama, to pick up a load, and then I'm taking it tomorrow to um, to um, Indiana. If I had a fishing pole, you just getting out here? You just getting out here? You yeah, huh? You been out here before? You catch good stuff out here? Huh? Ripley, don't you come out here? You better not jump. I wonder if he gonna jump in the water. He ain't gonna jump in the water, huh? You not afraid of dogs, huh? Oh, okay. He on bite. He's scared of you more than anything. What you fishing with? Crankbait. Huh? Crankbait. What you say? Crankbait. What's crankbait? Like that, what's that? It just imitates a fish. And it oh, oh, the fake bait. Yeah. Okay, okay. What you catch out here? Bass. You can catch bass out here? Oh, wow. I'm scared of Uh-oh. I wish I had a pole. So he's out here fishing. I could have got a pole and can and I got a pole in the truck, but I ain't got everything set up. I think he got hung up, so he gotta go get his line undone. But um hey y'all. Let me see. Look at Ripley all up in by the water. Don't you jump in, Ripley, because if you jump in, I'm not jumping in after you, baby. You're going to have to be on your own. You just walking all on the bridge like you know what you're doing. Ripley. Don't jump in the water, because if you do, I, I'm not going to be able to go get you, honey. Did you get untangled? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh oh. This is a nice little place. You from around here? Oh, okay. But yeah, you come out here. They don't. Ain't ain't that many people out here. You just come out here and relax and go fishing. This is a nice little place. Ain't none y'all ever been here? And then I guess the chicken plant 
it's like right a half a mile down that way the chicken plant is and then when they get ready for me they'll call me and i'll go get uh they'll call me and i'll go get loaded but this was my second um this was my second cancellation i was like but you know what that's one thing i like about uh not having uh being dispatched and working by miles because two of my loads canceled um two of my loads canceled this week so but i drove to them so since i drove to them i still get paid for the miles that i drove to my location so it wasn't a total waste because it took me two hours to get there and um I got paid for going there and then I got paid for going from uh, Columbus, Georgia all the way up here. So it's a, it ends up being the same amount of miles and my load that I got that's going to Indiana tomorrow ends up, um, it cancels each other out. So um, the good thing is they didn't, Ripley, okay, thing is they didn't, um, take a long time to get me another load so this time when i got here to pilgrim they had went ahead and um said i had the right numbers my load just ain't ready yet they'll be calling me but i'm about out of hours anyway so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go down to that um well wyndham hotel right down the street and uh check in over there until in the morning take my break and get out and me and ripley get out the truck so it's not a bad day. I'm happy. I'm just happy. I'm just happy to be in the South. <laughs> I'm just happy to be in some warm weather because I could be up somewhere in Illinois or uh, 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 Pennsylvania or somewhere that's cold. But it's real nice. It's real nice out here. It really is. But I just wanted to come and say hey to y'all. Let you know I'm back at work. I've been back for about a week now. So I'm back at work and um, back on the road. But that, I don't know what kind of plant that is, but the chicken plant is like down there. And, um, but this is a nice place. For, I don't know if any of y'all ever been over here to pick up a load. But they have a whole lot of um, R.E. Garrison trailers over here. So, but other than that, y'all, I'm just out here working. But I like to have fun while I work, too. So, look at that boat. Can y'all see that? I wonder if I wave at them if they wave back. But look, this is a nice little place. They ain't got but like one, one little hotel here, but it's a nice little hotel on the lake. So it's not that much, about $99 for tonight. And then I'll just stay there and get up in the morning. And we'll be in Indiana tomorrow to drop our load and continue on. Ripper, don't you fall off that cliff. Come back here but other than that y'all i'm waiting on them to call me and i just wanted to come and check in with y'all i will talk to y'all later bye